Hello everyone, it is Anthony with Land Title, and I just wanted to bring you a quick update on the Louisville market. If we look at the detached homes in Louisville, we're really seeing some just incredible demand over the past year. We've had 70% less active listings over the last year, not because homes aren't coming on the market, but because buyer demand is so high. You've seen a 17% increase in sales price on average in the Louisville market. If you own a home there, congratulations, you have made a lot of money. If you would like to buy in the Louisville market, it's not too late, right? 2021 is going to be an incredible year again. There's just nowhere to build, right? So if you own, lots of people are sitting on that property. There's a lot of demand. Everyone wants to live close to Boulder. Boulder and uh, it's also fairly accessible if you're trying to get back into the Denver metro area. So wanted to touch on a couple of points here, that green line there being active inventory is record 10 year lows, maybe even more than that. But as far as we can tell, you know, these are unprecedented times where buyer demand being so high, supply being so low, it's gonna take years to recover from the low amount of supply. If you look more at uh, the average sales price, right? These record appreciations, the average sales price in Louisville right now is at you know $860,000. We have a 124% increase in that price. That doesn't necessarily mean that all of you that own a home in Louisville gained $124,000 you know, in equity. But what it does mean is that on average, that's how much it rose. So there's a lot more luxury coming into Louisville. A lot of people are moving there because of its proximity in the county and how centralized it is. And they're paying top dollar for that, right? There's a lot of you know, new projects coming on. So exciting stuff happening in Louisville, definitely something to watch on for the next year. There is a lot of cool stuff happening as far as the amount of solds too. With the year of COVID that we've had, right? We had shutdowns, we had all this stuff that came on. Look at May, you know, we had a third of the amount of sales that we should have had if you look at last year. And we did have a pretty good recovery. The only real issue being the fact that there's just nothing to buy in Louisville. So you really see that increasing those average sale prices. And instead, we we ended the year a little short. You know, this is kind of the anomaly in the marketplace in Boulder County. Most places have been up in sales for the year, but without inventory, it's really hard to have a home to purchase, right? We just can't build in the area where there's no land to build on. So that's pretty fun and it's pretty important to look at. One thing, this might be taking the cake for the lowest amount of inventory in all of Boulder County. We are less than a week worth of inventory on the market. So what that means for you as a buyer is get out there and look the second things come on the market. If you're ready to make an offer, you gotta make offers immediately, right? You gotta come in top dollar, all these fun things, right? You're not overpaying for homes. If you're paying more than asking price, it's a negotiation. The market always brings those numbers to where they should be, right? Lots of consumers out there looking for homes right now. You definitely need to stay competitive, but down 67.5%, unreal. Days on market. This is just going to show you kind of where buyer demand has been in the Louisville market and it has been very steady the entire year, right? That doesn't normally happen. It's usually very cyclical and seasonal. You start to see demand rise as springtime comes into summer. And it's just not like that right now. We're really seeing demand stay very consistent, very steady because there's just not enough to purchase. And who doesn't want to live in Colorado? And we're seeing that, you know, affect us more and more. So take a look at that one. If you have any other questions, you want to talk about other marketplaces, please reach out to me. This is Anthony with Land Title, and I hope you have a great day.